Happy and happy, happy Parents Day, Day, everyone. Listen, brothers and sisters, we just want to encourage you, you know, in this wonderful life, God allows us varied opportunities to become true parental brothers and sisters to one another. And you know, one thing that is so assuring in this season is God is restoring the true parental consciousness of humanity with men and women becoming one at heart in particular moving to the rhythm of the image and likeness of God. And you know, the Bible tells us, yes, as God is our shepherd, our heavenly parents, like our parents shepherds, our child, guys a child, the Lord said, he will lead us in the path of righteousness for his glory, for his name's sake. So even though when we walk through the paths of the valley of the shadow of death, oh my goodness, you know where we are on? We are walking on the Appalachian Trail. It is not the valley of the shadow of death. However, we are grateful that God is leading us in the path of righteousness. So, Heavenly Parents, we just want to thank you. I want to tell the world to be encouraged that, you know what, for those of you who may be downtrodden, feeling like nobody cares for you, no, God cares for you. You know what God is doing in many people's lives? He's proving it. He's going to lay a table before you in the presence of your so-called enemies. People who do not really appreciate you and thank you for that parental love that God has. And what will God do? God will bless you more. Especially when you walk in rhythm as husband and wife, as a true parental figure to the world. That's for everybody, male and female, to come together in blessed union. My dearest wife, I love you. Happy, you happy Parents happy Day. Parents. Day. And namaste, namaste to everyone. Peace. Peace.